In a traditional Chinese society that cares a lot about social status and age, protagonist Shen Nang in the film Send Me to the Clouds cares very little about either. Played by Chinese star Yao Chen, who won Best Actress for her portrayal at this year's Tokyo Film Festival, the character is more preoccupied with her career and her road to self-discovery. It's a story that resonates with first-time director Tang Chong Chong. I would say 30% is from my own experiences. When I began writing the script for this film, I looked around and realized that in Chinese films, there's more attention to the marginalized women, like women in the countryside or in blue-collar work. But there's actually much less attention on women at the center of society, like women with college degrees and in the workforce. That's why I had the urge to tell my own stories, my frustrations, hopes, and longings in life. At a screening of the film in Washington at the D.C. Chinese Film Festival, the director also spoke candidly about criticisms of the film, most notably its focus on sex. And the so-called leftover women of China, or those unmarried past the age of 26. The social norm is that women should not display their desires on the big screen. Even if we are offending people who get embarrassed by watching these types of scenes, we think this is a step toward driving a change in society. How important was it for you to have this kind of story and movie out in China right now? I really see this as an opportunity to showcase the power of female moviegoers in China. This is an audience group that has long been overlooked. They've become more affluent and they go to the theaters more often. So I think the market is going after good female directors who can produce those stories through a female lens. And for those who aspire to follow Tong's path into film directing, my advice to aspiring female directors would be, just be truthful to your story. If you're confident you have a good story, you either put it online through digital media or you bring it to the big screen. Your story can be heard and could be applauded too. Connie Lee, CGTN, Washington.